Welcome to the channel guys. Okay, so it's been a while since I've updated. What have I been doing? As you can see in the picture, I have been dealing with the turbo return. Why have I been dealing with it? Because this is the original, that one there. You can see the diameter is tiny. I have a feeling that it's been backing up into the back of the turbo because it can't flow enough. So what I've done is I've made the diameter bigger and then I will be flowing that in back into the, the sump. Now, the other issue I've been getting is back pressure. So, I have decided to sort, try and sort that out. So, I have added a new T-piece to the um, sump. I'll show you that now. That is... There, as you can see, that's been added to it. That's that. Uh, and the whole plan is this is going to go on the front there as you saw in the other video I'm, I think if I put that on there that's going to go on top of there in there this here this main ho um, hose goes into the top half of this part of the engine I'll be teeing off of this hose and I'll be attaching this to it so it goes thus and it will be then drawing constantly on boost and on idle so it'll be creating even more vacuum now the only reason why i want to do this is because i don't uh, i think the turbo has been backing up with the amount of oil going up it and i don't really want it backing up in there because it's been leaking so all in all it's been an absolute nightmare but i'm hopefully that i've got there also i have dealt with the sump the sump isn't leaking anymore hooray i'm happy for that it's been an absolute nightmare. I've taken this subframe down more times than I would care to count. And I'm hopefully that I don't have to at least take it down for another six months because these are notorious for leaking these cars. So I'm happy with that. Everything's all sealed up. I'm, I'm happy, completely happy. Very, very happy. Now, I would like to give a shout out to Ace Hoses. The guys over there, I, it's dark right now, so I can't even show you and there's a lot of vans in the way. But Chris, Ron, Andy, all very knowledgeable guys. This is where I got all of these connectors from. If I show you down there, that's that there, that all the barbed fittings. They helped me out a great deal. Very, very knowledgeable and very, very patient, especially for a person like me. Now, they helped me with that barb down there as well. Obviously that, and I can match up certain things. If you need any um, hydraulic prob uh, issues or if you've got any uh, problems like this one here, like I've got here, and even um, lines, they can sell you lines. You know, they've got things, they, if they can't get it there, they'll get it next day. They're, they're very, very good. Um, it's, it's just been a godsend to be able to have some, some place like that. Anyway, shout them out. Anyway, shout out to them. They've really, really helped me out on this build, and I'm sure it's not going to be the last time I'm going to see them. Anyway. That is the end of the video. I will, oh, by the way, they're not sponsoring me, so don't worry. Uh, I have to pay for everything that I've been doing. Don't worry. Okay, right. I uh, will end the video now. If you like what you see, like, share, and subscribe. Cheers.